For the Friedel-Crafts alkylation, saya bahagikan kepada dua jenis mekanism. For the first one is the mechanism with primary alkyl halide. So untuk primary alkyl halide, elektrofa yang akan kita hasilkan adalah Lewis acid base complex. Okay, macam mana kita nak hasilkan Lewis acid base complex? Okay, saya akan tunjukkan. So for example, this is our alkyl halide, primary alkyl halide. So bromine salah satu lompat akan buat ikatan dengan aluminium. So macam biasa. Okay, and but then, okay. Kita akan dapat CH3, CH2, Br, and then we have Al, Br3. Di mana Al akan jadi negatively charged, this Br akan jadi positively charged. So, ini adalah our Lewis Acid Base Complex. Okay, so dia yang akan bertindak sebagai elektrofil yang akan kita gunakan dalam step yang kedua nanti. Okay, so apa yang berlaku pada step yang kedua, okay, salah satu double bond pada kita punya uh, benzin ring ni, dia akan attack carbon yang attach pada Br+. Okay, so antara carbon and also this Br, barulah dia akan terputus, Br akan dapat kedua-dua elektron. So, arenium ion kita yang pertama adalah, okay, so kita akan dapat okey salin balik yang mana kita tak usik okey this double bond tak usik this double bond pun tak usik and then dekat sini CH2 CH3 ya akan kita buat ikatan okey sebab dia attack pada carbon yang attach pada this, this Br+ okey so dia akan buat ikatan dengan this carbon and then belakang dia ada CH3 kita salin je balik okey and then here we got one hydrogen sebab dia tak keluar lagi so this is our first arenium ion so macam biasa kita akan buat dia punya resonance structure Okay, so tunjukkan dia punya resonance structure. And then don't forget we get AlBr4- here. Okay, so kita ada Br, okay, Al, Br3 and then the negative charge, negative charge is on this aluminium. Okay, barulah kita pergi kepada the next. Okay, so kita nak buang the H+. Okay, so kita putuskan ikatan antara this Al and Br. So, Br dapat dua-dua elektron. And then ambil the H+, so that we will get HBr later. Okay, and then dekat sini kita akan dapat double bond. Okay, so from here, we get our double bond back. Okay, and then dekat sini ada CH2, CH3. And then we have the... AlBr3, okay, our loose acid back and then also HBr as our side product. So, this is it for the primary alkyl halide. Alright, so the second one uh, in Friedel Craft alkylation, saya akan tunjukkan macam mana kita nak buat mechanism untuk secondary ataupun tertiary alkyl halide. Okay, sebab so, uh, untuk secondary dengan tertiary, the formation of elektrofil dia berbeza dengan yang primary. Kalau primary tadi, kita ada Lewis Acid Base Complex. Okay, untuk secondary dengan tertiary, our elektrofil will become a carbocation. Okay, so macam mana kita nak hasilkan the carbocation? Okay, the first step. Okay, we take our alkyl halide. So, this one, for example, I use the secondary uh, alkyl halide. Okay, so one of the lompat pada Cl akan buat ikatan dengan uh, ferrum. Okay, sebab saya gunakan FeCl3 as my Lewis acid. Alright, so what would happen here? Okay, the chlorine. Okay, will attach to the FeCl3. So, kita akan ada negative charge on the Fe and then positive charge on the chlorine. Okay, and then we are going to break the bonding between this carbon and also our halogen here. Okay, so di mana Cl lebih elektronegative, Cl we get both electron. Okay, and then we will form a carbocation. Okay, so in this case, our carbocation here is the secondary carbocation. Okay, so we have the secondary carbocation and then we will get the FeCl4 minus. Okay, so kita ada FeCl4 minus. The negative charge is on uh, ferrum. So, since by the formation of electrophile, electrophile kita adalah carbocation. Okay, uh, kita dah belajar sebelum ni, setiap mekanism yang involve carbocation, kita kena check sama ada dia boleh jadi lebih stabil ataupun tidak. Okay, so since here we got the secondary carbocation, but then kalau kita letak dekat sebelah-sebelah, dia akan jadi primary. So, the secondary one is the most stable compared to the primary one. Okay, so tak perlu ada rearrangement. So, after we get our 
electrophile which is our carbon ion here okay kita akan teruskan dengan the second step okay second step formation of arrhenium ion so we are going to react our benzene okay kita akan ada kita punya benzene and then we are going to react it with our electrophile which is the carbon ion okay so the secondary carbon ion okay and then here one of the double bond okay dia akan uh, buat ikatan dengan this carbon ion okay so what we we get here is okay we have the our first arrhenium ion di mana this two bonding kita tak usik so kita salin je balik okay and then here kita dah buat ikatan dengan carbon okay kita boleh letak dekat sini atau dekat sini so let's say i put it here okay so ch3 ch ch3 and then here we got hydrogen but then this carbon dia akan kurang ikatan so this is our first arrhenium ion okay and then show the Uh, resonance structure for this arrhenium ion right so we we got three resonance structure okay 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 so show the delocalization of the electron in the benzene ring okay and then after that barulah kita buat the loss of h plus so kita akan buang this hydrogen okay and then we will get our benzene ring back okay so choose the first arrhenium ion Okay, ambil first arrhenium ion. Right. Okay, and then we are going to remove this hydrogen. Okay, kita akan reactkan balik dengan kita punya uh, FeCl4- tadi. Okay, so this is our FeCl4- di mana ikatan antara Fe dengan klorin akan putus. Klorin got two Uh, electrons and then one of the lone pair on the chlorine akan buat ikatan dengan H plus ikatan antara this carbon and hydrogen akan menghasilkan double bond here ok so we will get ok our product ok so this is our product isopropyl benzene and then uh, FeCl3 our Lewis acid back and also the HCl as our side product So that's it untuk Frida Craft Alkylation.